Hey, what's up, y'all? Back for another authentic verification of the um, Atmos. Not the Atmos Air Max 1, but the Atmos uh, Nike Zoom Vapor RF times Air Jordan 3. So, as you know, this is just as limited and as coveted as the Atmos Air Max 1. But um, anytime you have the Jordan 3, and I know it's been a minute since I've done a the last authentic verification, but the cement threes have black cement threes have kept me busy. So I'm just making sure, just making sure you guys know that I've been busy. Um, let's get to it. So I got two different sizes to do: size nine and size ten. All right, and um, let's get to the box first before I get to the UPC and the rest of that. We'll get to the box because the box is great. It's a fantastic box. And um, <clears throat> one pair that I have, the box is kind of dinged up pretty bad. But it's still in great shape. And the paper isn't in these boxes because they came from the... Um, this was like a really good find, man. I was at the Nike clearance store. So um, give it up to the Nike clearance store. Friends and family starts on February 22nd. And hopefully you guys are signed up for Nike.com and you signed up for the email. So you got your 30% off coupon. But let's uh, get to the box. I'm going to go straight to the top first. Make sure I back up so we can stay in focus. All right. So you see on the top of the box is the uh, Jumpman and the uh, RF, the Roger Federer logo. And the in the middle, the logo has the time sign is in... Um, Jade, clear jade. Side of the box has the tennis court. All right. Opposite side, it's tennis court. The end, tennis court, same logo that's on the top. And on the front, it's the label. So for the size 10, I'll do the UPC now before I open the box up and we get into that. Oh, the bottom of the box. Now, the bottom here is a little bit different. I may need to move up and zoom so you can see it. All right. So you see the trademarks that are on the box. And, <clears throat> excuse me, the Nike Swoosh and Just Do It Names and Designs, a trademark of Nike Inc. and its affiliates. All right. So let's get to the UPC codes for verification. Uh, size 10, UPC is 885-176-235-414, and there's a 14 at the end. Style code is 709-998-031. That's black, clear jade, and white. Retail is $200. So we open it up, and you can see the, the logo or the stamp. The logo that's on the top of the box has been pressed in, too the box and you can actually see it on the opposite side we also have our red stamp here so we can do a date verification all right that's um always important and the date on this box is 17090821 so let's kind of figure out if we can decipher that actually there's a b at the front b 17090821 so that's got to be um, 17 is the year. 9 8 is your date. So I think this was probably stamped on 9 8 21. But 9 8 17. So when we look on the inside at the actual shoe, like I said, there's no paper on the inside of it. But what you will notice, like I said, is the stamp for the logos comes through really clearly. You can see it on the inside of the box. Same thing on the inside down here. And I'll come back to the number when we look at it and verify it. All right. So it's the Zoom Vapor, which is a tennis shoe. And it's a Roger Federer shoe. So the logo on the side of the shoe, there are no shoe inserts either. All right. But shoes haven't been, I don't even think these have been tried on. This has been tried on. You can tell because the front toe is a little bit crumpled there. So on this size 10, the front toe has been bent up a little bit, but the leather is super soft on it. And without the shoe, inserts then that's going to be bent anyway but the uppers are really clean on this shoe so let's get into the details the small details on the shoe um, there are pops of jade on the eyelets 
in here at this eyelet. The jump band on the tongue is jade. The inside is jade. On the footbed, on the insole, you have the tennis court. The outsole is the XDR. And obviously that's for um, rough surfaces. Anytime you see that XDR, there are Kobe's that are made with XDR as well. The back, the Nike Air on the back is in jade. And that is the left shoe. The heel counter is a gloss paint. It gives it that really kind of familiar Jordan 3 look. And then the logo on the side of the shoe, the RF, is in jade. All right, and that's the left shoe. And here's the right shoe. Same thing. And you can look at the toe box and see how soft that leather is. You know, typically you would say, oh, man, somebody tried that on, but nah, nobody tried it on. It's just really good premium tumble leather. All right, so let's get these two together. And then I have to do the size nine. So we'll do both shoes in the same video here. So let me give you a 360 flip here. All right. And these will be available on the website. So I'll put the link right here so you can click and go through. And I'll put them up at retail. So I'm not trying to beat you guys up, man. And really, this is for the people that have come to the website and who've been watching the videos and the new subscribers. I appreciate you guys and the older subscribers who've been with me this whole time. You know I'm getting back into the shoes extremely heavy the way I used to be, which means I'm going to be coming across stuff like this all the time. So you just kind of have to check the website every day and stay on top of it. But that's the size 10. So let's get you that size 9 UPC. Okay, I'm going to put that down right there. And here's the size 9. And the size 9 UPC is 885-176-235-391 and it's a 14 at the end. And that's the size 9. And let's get that open. So you can check this out. Now the 9 actually still has the XDR hang tag on it. But nobody's going to keep that on there. That's not like a Jordan hang tag. It's a piece of cardboard. Just telling you about the durability of the outsole. And you see how this rigor on the side is for when a tennis player is stopping, they have to have a lot of traction there. So that's what you have. All right. But that's the size 9. And I didn't look at the date for that shoe. So I'll pick it back up. And I could go through the rest of these, but since they're both 10s and 9s over there as well, I'll go back and look at the date on this one. This one is B17090921. So let's look at the date on the inside here for production. Hold up. It's 050817 to 082117. So 0921 This one is 082117. So the dates fall within line. All right. So it it sinks. A lot of the times we've found that those boxes, the boxes are printed at a different time, but it's always very close to the date of production that's on the shoe. All right. Now on this one, we had a stamp that was B17090821. Uh, and, and this also gives us another opportunity to 0608170821717. All right, yeah, and that's perfect. 0821117. Yeah. So we got the numbers there correct. Now, real quick, that 10 0817121. Let's look at another 10 and see 17090821. Same stamp. So the tens actually do bear the same stamp. So we got a pretty good grasp on this stuff, man. And now this size nine box, you see how it's wrinkled right here. Sorry about that. It's all wrinkled right there. I'll put this one on the side at $189.99. So it's just a wrinkled box. Toe box is great. Everything is good inside. So that's it. Hopefully you guys are cool with that video. And um, click right here if you want to get a pair of these. There's only three... Tens and two nines. That's all that's in stock. So whoever gets them gets them quick. So I have one pair of the nines priced at one eighty nine ninety nine. The rest of the shoes will be at one ninety nine ninety nine with free shipping. That's it, y'all.
Peace.